Hello everyone, so today I'm gonna edit a couple more photos from the Fujifilm X-T2. Let's get started. And these are the presets that are selected by the... Um, so there's a for this photo preset and then there's all preset. Let me check out this one. This is the new one. Go to 25 and then let me update the highlight save. And then increase the contrast, increase the sharpness and then the tone a little bit so let me double check this one and you can check the on the filter there's a character you can double check the character do you want more green or more red and then the warm like warmer or colder i can choose the colder one just to and then the strength the strength let me double check so we can do it like this uh, that's an example I, I like this one so let me add it so we can add it like this as the favorite uh, so we can use later and then we can update the um, the order like this so we can update the order in here and then depends on which one do you use the most so let me save it okay so let's get back to here and then save the tone exposure slightly reduce a little bit more and then increase the contrast a little bit increase the sharpening so i'm gonna rotate a little bit and uh, this one is the 16 mm f 1.4 uh, wide angle lens so i want the leading line from the stop sign to the portrait um, let me double check this one okay so let me say we increase the contrast a little bit so that's the before and after um you can adjust the uh the hsl also so if you want less uh, yellow in the background also so i can adjust a little bit of this so to make it a little bit cleaner tone uh, if you don't want too much uh, yellow on it so let me copy edit and then paste it to here and then I'm gonna update the rotation a little bit and slightly rotate here okay so that's good so about uh, in the middle have the equivalent uh, space in here so let me save it save and then let me update the next one so uh, as you can see that the lighting for the street are very similar and uh, it can be just copy and paste a similar tone on it so let me add this one a little bit more building for the different style and um, the overall is good uh, so let me save this one save this one so next is the 50 mm f 1.2 56 mm f 1.2 so let me go to um, choose a different one so this is an e5 let me double check the e5 and the the order so let me update the order maybe um, HB2 here so I can use the uh, U, U3 for this one so increase the sharpness slightly highlight save tone and then um, make sure the 4x5 crop for the Instagram I can reduce a little bit of the uh, blue in the background so it's increase the contrast a little bit more okay so the next couple one are similar so let me paste them into here and uh, because the left side has more space than the right side so I try to make it equivalent and then we can do a half body crop just don't uh, crop on the joint 
of the body uh, just uh, make sure of that and then let me save it and then the, this one is too bright so I'm gonna reduce the exposure a little bit and then the tone highlight safe and then do a 4x5 crop on here let me save for that and this one we can try the e5 on here so we can try e5 just for some different tone in it so e5 has more faded tone in here so and the base for the um for this is the classic chrome if you just search a uh, sing xt2 setting you can just find that uh, setting on that classic chrome I also uh, did a video on all the simulation mode also Classic Chrome was the one of the first uh, simulation that I used uh, So let me slightly adjust the exposure And then increase the sharpness, slightly adjust the uh, cropping also So I like the bokeh on the back So I leave most of the bokeh in the frame So let me save that And then this one is too bright. I'm gonna reduce the brightness a little bit. And then double check the um, E5 for this. Slightly increase the contrast, even reduce a little bit more, but not too much because uh, it will become very dark in the front. So slightly adjust the cropping. Okay, so I can save this one So let me copy this one and then paste it to the last shot right here Paste it here And then we can start the editing So I, I feel that like I need to crop it a little bit closer because I like the side profile in here. So and left and right make sure the equivalent of the spacing left and right slightly up a little bit more. The left side still have a lot more room on the left side so I'm gonna adjust that. Okay so that's good and then I save it. So that's it uh, for today and thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more video coming up. Bye!